Welcome to the lesson on Two Rescuer BLS in Infants. In this video, we'll discuss step-by-step -step procedure for providing BLS in infants with two rescuers. If you're not alone with the infant, first, shake their shoulders and talk loudly to them to determine if they're responsive. Then, assess their breathing. If the infant does not respond and is not breathing or is only gasping for air, then send the second rescuer to call 911 and get an AED. If you're not in a healthcare facility, or activate emergency response system and get a defibrillator if you are in a healthcare facility. Feel for the infant's brachial pulse for no more than 10 seconds. If you cannot feel a pulse or if you're unsure that you feel a pulse, begin CPR by doing 30 compressions followed by two breaths. If you can feel a pulse but the pulse rate is less than 60 beats per minute, begin CPR. This rate is too slow for an infant. When the second rescuer returns, begin CPR by performing 15 compressions yourself and two breaths by the second rescuer. Give compressions using the two thumb encircling hands method. Be sure not to press on the end of the sternum as this can cause injury to the infant. Compression depth should be 1.5 inches, that is four centimeters, and the compression rate should be at least 100 to 120 per minute. Use AED or the defibrillator while continuing CPR until further help arrives or until infant's condition normalizes. This concludes our lesson on two rescuer BLS in infants. Next, We'll review normal heart anatomy for PALS.